Whenever we yawn, we cover our mouth. It's called etiquettes. But there is another reason why. If something enters our mouth, if we don't cover it, and then we would cough. And if something strange comes out of it, just like that villager, when he coughed, because he didn't cover his mouth, a feather came out. Oh, y'all have not heard that story. Have y'all? Let me narrate it again. Maybe you have heard it. Maybe you haven't heard it. A long time ago, there was a villager who was resting outside his house one afternoon. And then he gave out a big yawn, opened his mouth wide and didn't cover it. And then something landed inside his mouth. He coughed out loud and something fell out. He looked down. It, it was a feather of a bird, egret bird, rarely seen in that area. Is this bad omen? I can't see the bird around. He went inside. He was so worried, full of fear. He told his wife. The secret was too heavy for both of them. They kept quiet and when the night came, the wife couldn't handle the secret. It was too heavy. She couldn't sleep a wink. She tossed and turned. She couldn't sleep a wink. The next morning she decided to share the secret with someone she trusted. The neighbor's wife. Listen, I'm going to be telling you something. Promise me you won't tell it to anyone. Why would I tell it to anyone? Tell me, tell me what it is. You know what happened? My husband was sitting outside and she told everything. That night, the neighbor's wife couldn't sleep a wink. The secret was too heavy. She tossed and turned. She couldn't sleep a wink. And the next morning, she told everything to her husband. The husband, the man, did not wait for the night to toss and turn. He went and told his friend. His friend told his wife. His wife told her friend. And from mouth to ear, mouth to ear, it went on. The whole village knew. And when it went around, the story changed. From coughing one feather, it became coughing out hundreds of different kinds of bird. All the villagers were curious. They started to gather around this man's house as if some entertainment show was going to happen. The man tried to explain, it was just a feather, not birds. Please, please, please go away. But the crowd kept coming in day after day. It went to the other village. From there also people came. From far away land people came. It became so much. And the man was so harassed that he packed up and left that village. Now what happens with a rumor? When it spreads, it spreads like fire. So when you're told a secret, it's supposed to be a secret. I hope you enjoyed this story. This story ends here. Till next story. Bye-bye for now.